Hey everyone, I'm back now. So I had to end that recording yesterday because uh, I don't like to record when people are home and some people got home, so I had to stop. But uh, anyway, we're all good now, we're clear, so I'm able to record once again. So let's just get right into it. Okay, so we were heading over here to Kikiri Forest trying to uh, find... I forget where we were going. Uh, was it, I think, Death Mountain? We're heading to Death Mountain. Yes, this is where we wanted to go. Let me just uh, save the actual game real quick. Oh, wait. What did I just do? Okay, that was stupid. Okay, anyway. Where does the owl take me? Let me just do a quick save and find out. Owl. Oh, I know you're only 400 years old. Yeah, yeah, we get it. We get it. You're only 400. Okay, shit, you're useless. Okay, you suck, owl. Okay, let's see what's in here, then. Blue fire. God damn it, it always says about blue fire. Uh, sorry if my voice is a little weird. I kind of just woke up from a nap. So, uh, yeah. Oh my god, it's actually a great fairy's fountain. Well, I think we've, uh, found all the great fairy's fountains. I guess that's good. Okay, what's, uh, there's not a Skull Tula down here, right? Just these guys. Okay, let's get running backwards so we don't have to die. This music with this is kind of funny. I like this. So, I'm not sure what episode this is still, but uh, if you remember earlier, I was talking about listening to uh, stories that were narrated by uh, a guy called Mr. Creeps on YouTube. I uh, And I said my favorite was the sirens went off at 2 a.m. Now everyone is acting strange. Wanted to add a few things. Uh, I don't know if I mentioned it last time, but one of my uh, favorite stories that uh, I forgot the name of, I think, was uh, there was a zombie outbreak in the West in the 1800s, or something like that. That was really good. It may have been a bit uh, inspired or cliche to, like, you know, an unnecessary extent at, at points, but uh, it was really good, you know? But... Uh, yesterday, like last night, uh, for me, I have been listening to more, and I think I found one of my favorite stories ever written. Oh damn it, I missed. So this one was called, What Happens When You Write a Letter to Satan Instead of Santa? And I'm not going to give away too much, because it's honestly a great story to read, because it was just that entertaining. I thought it was going to be, uh, like, evil and horrible, like, you know, I thought it was going to just be, like, the most the most uh, sad, depressing story ever, right? But no, it wasn't. Okay, let's see what's in this chest and then I'll continue. Just a token. That sucks. Anyway, though, uh, about the story, yes, I thought it was going to be, you know, really uh, dark, depressing, and like, just, you know, overall, uh, <clears throat> that kind of story. And, uh, no, not at all, it wasn't. I got into it, and I'm not going to give away too much of it, because it was just, you should really go listen to it or read it yourself. But, uh, it was a multi-part, uh, reading. And it was more of a comedy than anything. And honestly, I kind of want to see an actual show made out of it, because I appreciated it and liked it that much. What's this say? Deku Nuts. Okay, Gerudo Valley. There's like nothing I can do here. So, I'm just gonna have to go back. I need to go down, or I'm sorry, not down, I think. I need to just go around this corner here, and I can pick up this, uh... Why can't I think? Oh yeah, I just woke up. Yeah, I need to, uh... <clears throat> Sorry, I had to clear my voice. I need to pick up this uh, bomb and I need to just throw it right down here. I missed. That was pathetic. Come on, give me another one. Give me another one. I just gotta throw it right down. Oh crap, I missed. Did I do the same exact thing again? No, I missed again. Wait, what? That was a hit? 
I'll take the win. Okay, so, what do you gotta say, dude? Oh, I thought you weren't gonna talk to me. Oh, that's what the sign says. Wait, what'd you just say? You actually decided to become a Zora. Oh. No, I'm not gonna marry you, I'm sorry, and you're not a Zora. You're having an identity crisis. Uh, okay. So I forget how to do this. Uh, there was something I was about to do, but I kind of don't know how to do it. I think it's like this. Hey, I did it! Okay, this is a compass for what dungeon? Water Temple. Who wants to bet this is the Water Temple? Wait, how do I mark down compasses? Oh wait, it, it's not necessary, I don't need to. Oh wait, now I know what I was here for. I was here for, uh, this. I have to... Yeah, that. That's all I needed to do. Okay, let's go see what temple this is. Uh, the... <clears throat> the suspense. Wow. Wow. Who the fuck would have thought? Oh my god. Trying to think of how... It, legendary this combination is right here. We have... The most hated and most annoying temple in the game. But also... Paired with the most annoying character in the game's music. I don't think there has ever been a more fitting pairing from a randomizer ever. I This is so amazing and legendary that I myself would never have considered to make this connection. This is something genuinely new to me. And I hate it. So I'm gonna leave. This is the worst. I never want to go back there in my life. Fuck this place. Fuck that temple. I called it because that stupid ass compass on the roof. I hate you, water temple. You fucking die. That, that's all I gotta say. That's all I've gotta say. You suck. You are trash. Leave me alone. I have never been so fully disappointed in my life. Ever. I was like really in my heart hoping for a forest temple. Or like, you know, anything other than the water temple. But, you don't always get what you want. And sometimes you- wow, you're a blank sign. How useful. Yeah, sometimes you though, you don't get what you- you get less than what you don't want. Or, wait, sorry. Sometimes you get, uh, far less than what you actually want. You get something that you don't want. And it would appear that today, that has been what I received. Okay, let's just see what's inside these buildings. Oh, Mido's house. Much, much helpful, uh, house you have there, Mido. Jesus Christ, music. Calm the fuck down. Is this the shooting gallery? I, I won this one, right? Or is this the adult one? What's this say? Whatever, let me get out of the Shadow Temple shooting park. Whatever. Okay, what's this sign say? Can I read it? No. Okay. Uh, what's inside this box? Nothing. Okay. Uh, oh, it's this guy. Hello. I'm not gonna talk to you, though. I don't like you. Jesus, these horses, man. It Horses. Sorry, horses. These horses are freaking weird, man. Fucking boss theme music. Horses that sound like whatever that is. Is that Ganon? Phantom Ganon. Actually, this makes sense. It pairs up quite nicely. Okay, I'm gonna go see what is inside this building, though, and then we're gonna get out of here. Because I can't remember what's in here. Wow. Wow. You know, I should have remembered this. This makes a lot of sense. Why the fuck does this make so much sense? 
Well, I should have expected something stupid like that. I mean, that was trash. That was useless. That was so useless. Uh, okay, uh, I'm not sure what other open pathways there are for me to follow at this point. I think we're going to have to uh, follow, I would say, uh, maybe somewhere with Adult Link, because I think, I think we're kind of stuck. But um, I'm not sure, so I'm going to go uh, check some things out, uh, maybe around Hyrule Field still. Like, uh, I can't remember if I ever figured out where the uh, Lycalia door went, or uh, exit went. I'm hoping we can get one that leads us into, uh... Oh shit, can I get out of here? Yes, I can, okay. Anyway, I'm hoping I can find a path that leads me into, uh... The, uh, Hyrule Castle area. I forget what it's called, uh, you know what I'm talking about. Just Hyrule Castle area. You know what I mean. So, I need to go there, though, so I can, you know, talk to Zelda... No, wait, I can't even talk to her yet. Shit. Or can I? Because I, it considers that I have the uh, spiritual stone, right? But it doesn't actually... I don't even know how it works. I think I'm going to have to go there anyway, though. Because I think that's uh, what I need to do to uh, progress the story so I can uh, work with things like the Bomb Chew Bowling Alley. But I'm not entirely sure. Seems like, uh, seems like that's what I need to do, though. Otherwise, I'm not even sure. Maybe otherwise I'll have to locate the, uh, Deku Tree. But, uh, who knows? That could be quite an ordeal. I'm, I'm kind of hoping it's the, uh, prior rather than the, uh, ladder here. Okay, now uh, let me just start to climb this annoying wall. Aha! I defeated you! <laughs> I shouldn't have said anything. I shouldn't have said anything. I'm so glad I learned that trick. Like, it was taught to me from a YouTube video. I, I didn't know that they would not kill you if you stopped moving. Like, I, I guess they're based off of dinosaurs or something. Okay, leave me alone, Sc Oh, Jesus! Fuck! Shit! Ah, I stopped moving, though. You're unfair. I hate you, too. I really hate all of you. Let me just go with the speed up, because I'm not in the mood to waste my time. Okay, we're out. We're out. We made it. We win! Okay, so... Can I get some bombs, though? No bombs? Okay! Well, let's go see what's up here, then. This was, uh... Hyrule Field. Okay! So, now we're heading to the Lake Hylia area, which, uh, I should know where that takes me. Maybe I never actually went through it. That's, uh, you know... That's a possibility. A really stupid possibility, but a possibility nonetheless. Okay, I couldn't really uh, harvest anything there. Not enough time. This annoying ass guy behind me is very insistent upon flying after me as though he's a helicopter. I'm just gonna make this uh, trip go a lot faster. Holy shit, there's more! Oh, I forgot. I forgot, there's more. But wait, there's more! If you just want, for the small price of walking like 10 steps, you can encounter hundreds of P-Hats. Without any extra charge. Because, you know, that's what, uh, that's what everyone wants, right? I wish that did damage. Okay, can I, can I, like, kill these motherfuckers? I need some bombs! Oh god, it's a- I'm playing Call of Duty! Oh no! Okay, come on, give me some bombs! Oh god. Uh, quick scope! 
Okay, yeah, quick scopes. Okay, let me get some hearts here. These guys are very fucking persistent. Like, could you just fuck off already? Fucking go away. I'm trying to mine my own bit. God damn it! It's like I'm playing GTA 5 and some shit. Trying to run cargo with a level 30 in the lobby. It's just not possible. They're just little bitches and they don't know how to leave me alone. God damn it. Oh! Go away! Leave me alone! Oh shit, the fucking pee hats here. Damn it! Hate these motherfuckers! What the fuck is he doing? Is he broken? What is this guy doing? Oh shit, the little kid ones. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Oh god, they're after me. Oh god. That's that's my favorite sound, yeah. Mmm. Pea hats chasing me. Oh yeah, everyone loves this. I, I think this is why the game is considered 10 out of 10. Not for the amazing stuff, good dungeons, good story and all. No, 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 no. It's the chasing pea hats. Whoa, holy shit, didn't mean to do that. The F4 button makes the game speed up like that, but the F5 button is what I was trying to press to save. Wow, I think the game is really trying to tell me something, you know, uh... Just a little, just, just a little nudge. It's just like, hey, water temple, right? Yeah? No? You're not in the mood? Oh, well, too bad. You're still going to have to do the water temple. At some point, you're going to have to do the water temple while listening to that, that music, thinking about the owl while playing through that temple. Yeah, you're going to just love that. You're just going to have a great time. I know. Yeah, definitely be a great time for sure. If that's your definition of great, you are a messed up individual. Really. I mean that. Who could think that's a great time? It, 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 I just... No. Messed up time. Messed up time. Although, it is considerably better than, I guess, this music. So... I, I guess I'll be fair. Okay, let's see what's over here. I, there's no way I've already been here, have I? Uh, knowing, uh, knowing my luck, it leads to the fucking desert again. I mean, we already have so many paths leading to the desert, uh, but maybe this will lead to the actual important part of the desert, i.e. the, uh, fortress. But we'll see, you know, this, this could be anything. Hey, look at- I got lucky for one- this is exactly what I wanted! This is exactly what I wanted. Hold on, let me just check something real quick. Okay, I am recording. That's good. Oh, hey, oh, oh, hey, hey, what do you gotta say? You give me stuff, right? <gasps> oh! It's the big Goron sword! Whoa! That's good. That is a good item. Okay. Melon. You're awesome. I would have preferred the Kakeri sword, but hey! Thank you, Malin. You're so cool. Why am I being so nice to her? Whatever, you just... It's not like you didn't just give me a sword or anything. I should be nice to her. Let me kill this motherfucker. Uh, yeah. Oh! Oh, a map! The shadow... I can't even mark that. Whatever, I don't even care. Wait, I, I need to mark off the Skulltula. Uh, fuck is the Skulltula at? It's like, right here. Can I click it? Okay, we got that. Uh, okay, we're good to go. Oh, shit, time actually flows here. I forgot. Oh my god, I'm so used to GTA. I was actually uh, trying to move the camera with my mouse. Uh, uh, obviously, that didn't work, you know. So, how do I get through here? Should I just, like, talk to the guy and bribe him? Or should I just do what everyone else does and sneak past, you know? As a kid, I found out you can bribe the guy and sneak past him, but I wasn't sure how I did it, and uh, I also imagined it because no one else ever knew about it. Wow, this item doesn't work here. Well, good thing I'm not using you. I'm using a bomb, because that's what I like. 
Okay, what is over here? It could be something useful. 